All right, if you're getting the sensor P013A, O2 sensor, slow response, bank one, sensor two, for your Lincoln MKZ, mine is the hybrid 2015. I keep getting the same error. So what I've learned is, if you take it to the dealer or whatnot, they may tell you that you need to replace a sensor, the downstream sensor, or they may tell you you need a catalytic converter. I had the downstream sensor replaced, it still did it. So what we did is, if you see, you can easily do this yourself if you replace this with the screws, pull this off, the air filter cap off. You can get down here and this black one and this blue one are your up and downstream sensors. I'm gonna show you real quick what you need to replace it. I'm not gonna show you exactly how to do it because I just had my friend do it. Um, but I'm gonna show you what you need. A seven, eight inch wrench or you can have this tool right here, which will make it much easier. These are actually sensor socket sets, but the seven eights will still work. Uh, and I put on the top here, this is your down sensor. And I recommend you get the NTK brand. Uh, you get what you pay for. So NTK is very, you know, um, has guarantee with it as well. Very respectable brand. Uh, this is your upstream sensor. And after I installed them, you can see everything's green up top. My O2 sensor, when I hook my OBD2 re uh, reader up to it, I'm getting the O2 sensors green and everything else is green. So, so far so good. I have not had to put a catalytic converter on. Just wanted to share that with everybody. Um, save you some money. All right, thank you.